you put some cheeses and some meats with various accoutrements and you make the mouth water before anyone even approaches eating. This is an example of a board where pretty much all of the cheeses are very extreme. It's always a good idea to introduce something a little bit new, push people's limits just a little bit. One of the world famous blue cheeses, absolutely divine. It is a raw sheep's milk blue cheese from France called Roquefort. It is intensely strong, but also sort of sweet and rich. This is called mousse truffée, which is a chicken and pork liver mousse, which is filled with black truffles. So you talk about a rustic, delicious, decadent, oh, it's just so fantastic. Next, we're moving down to our first stinky cheese, which is a sort of a, a fun reference to an entire classification of cheese called washed rind cheeses. This is a cheese called Telejo. It is one of the oldest washed rind cheeses in the world and it is like silk. It is so smooth and creamy, but oh, so stinky. So it is really, really, really delicious. This is something called Bressaola, also from the far north in Italy, and it is a beautiful tenderloin of beef that is air cured. It's just absolutely delicious. It's very mild and not nearly as salty as a prosciutto might be. And then our final step, this is a cheese from upstate New York, and it is called Oleat. It is unpasteurized cow's milk cheese. It's an extreme cheese experience. It is just wonderful for what it is, but it is incredibly intense. And that's why we call this our extreme cheese and meat board.